Hey, good morning. Mario Gonzalez here at Navy to Navy Homes. Um, very important question here in today's blog. We get all the time with investment homes. Should I put down carpet or should I put down tile? Well, if you're going to make any improvements to your home or it's just that time to do some improvements, what I will tell you is the price can be much closer in carpet and tile than you really imagine. So, um, for instance, when we advise people, whichever way they're going to do, if you're going to put down carpet, then spend the majority of your money on the actual material itself the carpet that you're selecting and the padding that you're selecting because that will um, that will help ensure the longevity of it. On the inverse and tile, you really want to spend the money on the installation because you can have a great uh, tile, very expensive product, but if it's crummy installation, then you've really uh, kind of shot yourself in the foot. Likewise, you can take a less expensive tile product and really do a lot with the installation. You can angle it, you can make like a, uh, different patterns, etc., that, that people will do. You know, stagger. You can even have a tile that looks like hardwood floor. So, anyway, um, a little bit more about the carpet versus tile. Um, you can clean both. You can clean carpet over time, and you can also have tile and grout cleaned by most professional floor cleaners or carpet cleaners. They will clean those. What we do see is, that on average, tile will last much longer than carpet. However, you're about 50/50 on what people like. Um, the majority of people like carpets in the bedroom. It keeps the, the um, sound down in bedrooms. And if you just carpet the bedrooms, then it's much easier to replace if there's any damage or anything like that. It also keeps people from you know coming out and hitting the cold floor first thing in the morning. The counter to that is you do have a lot of people with allergies. And those people with allergies don't want any sort of carpet in the home. So what we do see is a lot of investors, they will in, put carpet down just in the bedrooms and then all the wet areas and the common living areas will be a hard surface, even to like the, the hallway leading up to the bedrooms. And that just makes it so you have your high traffic areas, you have tile, it's gonna last you a little bit longer. And then in the bedrooms, you've maximized it by saying, okay, I can mix and match carpets if I need to. You don't necessarily have to, um, you know, just so long as it looks close. So if you have more questions, uh, feel free to look at some of our other blogs, the getting your home rent ready, uh, some of the best improvements you can do, top tips to, to really maximize your rental, and, uh, and thanks for checking us out here.